Hi, my name's Keith. Welcome to my part of the woods. Uh, this is where nature calls and I do my duty. So hold on a second. Great Scott! So I had a dream uh, the morning of uh, May 31st. Um, special dream. And it also happened to be my buddy's birthday. He passed away. Uh, Oba. He's my, uh, my best friend. Um, so in my dream, I actually experienced the... Uh, the rapture, the Christian rapture, uh, ascension, uh, it's also called the event, and um, I'm going to talk about it. My uh, thought pattern is kind of uh, intermittent. I've had a stroke, so if I cut in and out with uh, segments, it's from now on into the future, it's, that's going to be why. It's not going to be because uh, I'm trying to cut the video a little bit shorter like some people do, okay? Okay, so today is June 2nd. Um, I tried recording yesterday. Well, I did record. I was a little bit too much in my uh, natural state. And uh, I want to be taken a little bit more seriously than in my natural state. And, uh, well, this is my natural state right here. Ah, it's snowing. <laughs> okay, back on to the dream now. Um, so in my dream, I was asleep. I wasn't uh, awake, coherent. I wasn't ready for the event. I, but uh, because my heart was in the right spot, in the right location, in the right vibration, and in uh, in God and Jesus and Christ, and uh, and uh, I'll put put your uh, your um, your word there, I guess. And in my dream. I was uh, asleep in bed. Uh, I was not coherent. Um, I wasn't ready for uh, the ascension process, which only took sec six seconds in uh, our perception of time. That's what it felt like to me. And so the first thing I noticed was a uh, warm pressure in my heart, and it, it uh, emanated out. I don't know how many feet. And it was just a warm pressure. It was a push. Um, and I compared it to uh, magnets. Ele electromagnetic uh, push and pull. When you take two magnets together and you try to hold them close together. And they keep pushing apart. But then you come off just slightly and you snap together. That's what the process felt like to me. And so after I started uh, feeling that pressure, the warm pressure, it got more and more tight and warm. And then it hurt. But it, it, was, it was like the feeling of love. It was pushing really hard. And so when I was awaking, I, I felt, kept feeling the pressure. It kept getting stronger, warmer. Uh, I didn't hurt. Uh, it, was, it was more a, a feeling of love. It was pushing and pushing. And um, I looked up into the sky. Uh, it was to the northwest. And I uh, started to black location. It was a dark red, like a, a, a burgundy red, and then it slowly got brighter into orange and to yellow. It was taking up the whole sky until it was white. And that's when I, uh, I felt the, the snap. It was like uh, watching the Star Trek uh, Enterprise. When it jumps into warp drive, you know, it starts up, shoots off, uh, or a Millennium Falcon. And so it's like a charge, and it's a pull and a throw. And it, it, it felt like it lasted six seconds. I went through it, and uh, it felt like I woke up. I was still asleep. It felt like I woke up, and I was seeing things differently. And that was before I just woke up. And so it actually felt like uh, a pulse, almost like uh, uh, coming, coming alive. It was just a big uh, gasp of air. And relief and it felt great. I was in the same location, just it was different, it felt a lot different. Still in the dark. Um, I knew what just happened. I was thinking about other people, hoping that they were there with me. Uh, but it was still dark in uh, my bedroom. The bed was there. I think it was my bedroom. I was very comfortable where I was. Um, and that's when I woke up. So if you'd like to actually feel this for yourself, take two magnets and slowly push them together 
and you could feel it push away. You could feel your hands push away, and then at just the right position, it snaps together. That's what I felt like. Uh, it wasn't scary. It was more uh, like a uh, anticipation of a roller coaster ride. You're going up, get to the top, and then you fall. You know, you uh, roll down. But it was more of a awakening process. So you you woke up at the top of the the, uh, the uh, roller coaster, and then wow, I know what's going to happen now, and then it happens. From this video forward, at the end of my uh, dream videos, I'm going to start putting a, a four links up. Um, a good inspirational videos uh, for becoming ready uh, for the process. Uh, and, uh, you know, it's not doom and gloom. It's not, hey, a new world order is here. Uh, you're about to be a slave. Uh, you know, fear is from, from uh, the dark side. And there's no need to fear anything. In the end, the best inspiration is going to be uh, on an individual basis, uh, what a person creates and brings forward to the, the world to bring joy and uh, inspiration to people. And these videos have helped me out, and from now into the future, I hope they do help you out as well. Bye!